Good morning, Blanco. Good morning. That's a great sit. So you know what? You get a treat. Good boy. Your brother is outside. Oh, there he is right there. He came back. You must have smelled that treat. You have to go boo-boo or something because you ran to that door. What's up, man? Rhino, sit. Rhino, you don't listen to him? Okay. Blanco, sit. Thank you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Sit. Good boy. All right, I'm going to check on the kids. There go Leon. I saw you. He disappeared. <laughs> it is 8.07, guys. Now, I read in the comment section that some of you said that at 7.44, you already be at school. Now it's 8. Oh, Leon tricked me again. <laughs> Boy! <laughs> What's up, man? So, Leon's wearing a Freddy Cougar sweater today. Hey, you Freddy Cougar for Halloween. Let's get it. Hey, guys. All right. Push it right up. Hey, Jalea, what you wearing at school today? You don't know. Oh my god, let me help you get some shoes to match. Okay. Okay. You're not wearing these, 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 these. Okay, you can wear nothing to school. <laughs> oh, okay, you can wear those, actually. Yeah, I'm black and blue, though. I mean, you could actually wear your blue shoes, too, your blue pods if you want to. Oh, yeah, because I got some black. On. Black in them, yeah. And I'm my what you wanna do? What you wanna do? Cause you don't got no red on, girl. I'm just saying, boo boo. Okay. Might have to put on them blue and black shoes. Leon's in a rush. What you wearing today, Freddy Cougar? B Burgundy. Burgundy. Okay. What are y'all two doing in here? Huh? What are y'all doing? I don't know what y'all doing. Y'all need to not do that no more. Get him, Blanco. Get him, Blanco. <laughs> Let me check on Carnation. I don't even hear her. Usually she's making noise, laughing, or doing something. Carn you know what? Ever since I bought you this bed, you've never been in it. I don't never see her in here anymore. Oh, you over there. Hey. How you doing, Carnation? Hi. Hi. You, you, you didn't see the eye drip? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I did right there. Eye drip? Uh oh. I get to see the eye drip because you got a pink eye. Wow. <laughs> Slippery. <laughs> Blanco. What? That one missed. I got it though. Nope, Nation. That one missed. You okay, Nation? You feel sick? No. You ready to go to school? For Halloween, you can be pink eye girl. You scare everybody away. Just be like, I got pink eye. Oh, I'm gonna be a zombie pink eye. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's three days, then it's four days. I wake up in the morning, then I, then I put my clothes on, and then I party. Wait, a party for what? For my birthday. Your birthday's coming up? Yeah. Oh my God, how many days? Four. Four days? Oh. One more day! Hey! Wait, she's not? It's not? Yesterday it was four, now it's three days. You don't even know your birthday. No, it's a good. Um, <laughs> Mom, I, you, you, what, you can. You uh, said, it, Mom said it's three days, but it's only gonna be four days. What? Wow. That makes sense. It's gonna be. Four days. Okay. What shoes you wearing in school today? Socks? No, no boogers. <laughs> what? Boogers. boogers? No boogers. Bugger day? We wearing bugger days to school? No, Wait, what's they called? Burgundy. No, she has to say it. Boogerdies. Boogerdies. <laughs> those are called bur <laughs> Booker tees? What? Burgundy. <laughs> Burgundy. Burgundy. Okay, call them Bordeaux. Burgundy. <laughs> what are y'all doing at the door? Y'all heard somebody or something? Y'all trying to run away? What's going on over here, bruh? Answer me, man. Right now, you the oldest. What you doing over here, bruh? What the? 
Wolfpack and Cool Kids, today is Halloween. I'm sure you already know that though, right? Now, it's crazy because the kids in royalty just left for school, all right? And I got right on Amazon Prime now, which is an app that I use to order things and have them shipped to my house within the hour. I know, that's crazy, right? But we live in a crazy time, 2017. Shout out to you, it's almost over. We're almost in the big year, 2018. Hopefully, it's a way better year than this year. And I really don't have much to complain about, but I'm sure we all have had a few bad days in this year, 2017. But I'm not here to elaborate on bad days. I'm actually here to talk to you guys about today's prank. I ordered some stuff off Amazon Prime now. As soon as Royalty took the kids to school, which was literally like six minutes ago, so Royalty should almost be on her way back. I ordered two different masks, guys. I even ordered a brand new hoodie, brand new jogging pants, just so it could be something that isn't out of my closet that I'm wearing, you know? The kids pretty much seen everything I got, but everything that I've ordered is brand new and they have never saw it. I got two masks, like I said, and a whole new, brand new outfit. So stay tuned, I'm waiting on Amazon Prime to bring that. Once they bring that, I will show you guys, because the kids will still be in school. Happy Halloween out there, even though I don't celebrate holidays anymore, thanks to royalty, guys. But. Hopefully everyone out there that is celebrating is gonna have a great day. Safety first, period, no matter what. When you're going out there, if you're just alone, you as kids, go in packs, don't go alone, you know? Or if you're with your parents, I'm sure your parents will have um, alternative things for you to do. But if you are going out alone, man, always protect yourself and be aware of your surroundings. Don't just be out there looking for candy and not actually paying attention to what's going on around you, okay guys? Now, we are gonna get ready for this prank, yeah! Alright guys, as you saw, last video was probably the first video in a long time that I didn't get any new shoes. Well, all that is about to change because guess what? As you can see, I got two new shoes in the mail today. So I'm very happy about that, guys, and I'm about to crack them open. So bear with me, all right? Finally got this box open, guys. I had a struggle with this box, but guess what? It's finally open, and it's very much looking like an old box, okay? This is looking like something from 2008 nine or ten okay i'm gonna let that box fall and we're gonna get straight to it this time unlike all the other times i'm not even gonna show nothing first we just gonna jump right into it but i kind of see okay i sold something that alone is letting me know exactly what this is because i know what i ordered that wasn't my size and i got it because i was super thirsty and i couldn't wait no more so guys i present to you the rising suns retro 12s that i already had in my collection but I got jacked for them, man. Now, I know I just got my house broken into, so you guys are probably like, wait, whoa, 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 they stole some shoes? I don't remember them. No, they didn't steal any shoes, guys. I got jacked for these before I was a YouTuber. Me and Royalty were living together in a house, and I had this friend on Instagram that was doing customizations to Jordans, and he was doing a very good job, at least on Instagram, it looked like. Um... So I got this guy's information, I DM'd him or whatever, and I, I, I talked to him about getting some shoes done, and this was one of the shoes, and then the other shoe was the Concord 11s, which I've already replaced since then. I sent him both the shoes with the money in the box, big no-no. He got the shoes, customized them, posted pictures on Instagrams, videos, everything, and then he stopped answering my phone calls. Now this is when I started to realize I got jacked, you know? So I started to rant on Instagram, and this guy ended up ranting back saying, well, sue me then. Sue me then if I stole your shoes because I'm prepared for this. I got a lawyer. He was super prepared to jack me, and he really did, and he got away with it, guys. His name is PZ um, Perry, something like that. He's from Indiana, Indianapolis, and I know one thing. If I ever see you, if you're watching this video, it's lights out for you, bro. You're going to have to go night-night. Real talk. You ever go night-night, nigga? Everybody go night-night, nigga. You get the bag and fumble it, I get the bag and flip it and tumble it yeah. Straight off the lot, 300 cash, and the car came with a blunt in it yeah. Lil' mama a thot, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag Ooh, guys, and this this box is actually looking like a Retro One box Ah, struggling, struggling, struggling Oh, shh, that would've been the first time I literally dropped the whole box of shoes <laughs> That would have been tragedy, but uh, I saved it. So yeah, guys, I noticed that this is a Retro One box because this is the only shoe that comes in a box like this. But not to mention, this box is ragged D, man. When did these come out? Oh, 2013, okay, so these came out four years ago, almost five years ago. They deserve to be a little busted in the box, but damn, checking out this shoe, it's, it's, this is Shadow One, man. It's a lot of dust on this shoe, or whatever that stuff is. I don't know, Black Club, you've never really done me like this. Looks like somebody had glitter on their fingers or something. 
I don't know what that is. I'm gonna have to take a towel to it. Um, I'm pretty sure I ordered a dead stock shoe. I don't even think they sell used shoes on Flight Club. Yeah, they don't because there's no crease. Obviously, Retro Ones are the easiest shoe to crease, and these are unworn. But they were in some type of environment where they got some type of sticky stuff looking like on it. I'm not too pleased with that. And these shoes cost up. Okay, that's probably what they did to it. They probably just threw it somewhere. But yeah, these shoes cost a pretty penny, and uh, I'm not too happy about this stuff that's on it. It looks like glitter, guys. Glitter doesn't come on these shoes. I know that because I had these shoes before, and they're not supposed to have any type of glitter. So uh, we might have a big issue here, guys. I might be having the email flight club. You get the bag and fumble it. I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. Yeah. Straight off the lot, 300 cash, and the car came with a blend in it. Yeah. Lil' mama a thot, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag. Two hours later. Wow. Just got back to the crib, and oh my god. Amazon Prime is legit, bruh. They brought all my stuff, and not only did they bring it, but they stacked it up all nice. They must knew I was gonna record this, bruh. It's Halloween, guys, and I know you're probably like, what the freak is this, right? So here it is, guys. I bought these Marvel comic book character candy bowl holders. We got the Hulk, Iron Man. We got this guy. I don't even know his goddamn name. Venom. There it is right there. Venom. And then we got Spider-Man. And then these three bags, guys, I have a super surprise. Today is Halloween, and I'm going to scare the crap out of my family with these bags right here. Now, no one knows what's in these bags. But these guys, these bags right here, they hold my Halloween costumes, which I will be using to scare the crap out of my family. Just wait on it, man. Guys, I think I just came up with the most brilliant idea I've ever had in my life. Now, since I want to remain anonymous to royalty, I don't want her to think it's me, okay? We did just have our house burglarized, so I'm pretty sure that everyone's on their P's and Q's. Royalty and the kids should be pretty scared by this prank that I'm about to pull off that involves these bags right here. These actual boxes are going to um, be used to lure the kids into the trap, and the trap will be what's in those bags. And follow me over here. Guys, like I said, I just came up with the most brilliant idea ever. And this refrigerator stands about five foot eight-ish. I don't know-ish. Um, but either way, guys, if I take everything out of here, I think I might have enough room to hide in this refrigerator. Now, the trap, the lure, those little boxes of toys, I'm gonna set them right over here somewhere to make the kids kinda wanna come over here. And hopefully, they do their normal routine, which is go in the freaking refrigerator and look for something, which ain't nothing ever gonna be in here. I don't know if it's just them, or was it every kid ever growing up. You always go in the refrigerator first, just to see if there's anything new in there, and then you're always disappointed. Um, but while I'm looking at it, I might have to cut this down all the way to zero where I'm standing in here because I ain't gonna freeze to death. But yes, guys, I will be standing in here with the Halloween mask on, with the costume that I bought as the black full hoodie suit, and I'm gonna try to prank the kids as they open this up. So I'm gonna have to find somewhere good to put a camera. Hey, royalty. I'll be back. Make sure you arm the house. Of course. I don't need to arm the house if I'm here, baby. I can close the door. I want to see you leave. I might be a while. I might go to the store. Okay, but I still want to see you leave. You locked the door? Oh, man. He almost set me up to feel you. Blanco, you was going to unlock the door? Nope. Yeah, Rosie, I want to just see you out. Make sure you're safe and everything, you know? There's burglars out here. You never know. There might be kidnappers and robbers. Yeah. That car looking clean. Clean. Love you. Wee, guys. She don't know what I got up my sleeve for her. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to play it cool right now. Bye, baby. You know what I'm saying? Watch out, Rhino. Yeah, guys, I had to play it cool. Man, let me make sure she left all the way. Yeah, she gone. Love you. She's not looking at me, though. But that's the good thing. Rhino, move. Move your butt out the way, dog. Man. Come on, buddy. Got stuff to do. Whew. Now I'm gonna have Blanco right here. I knew it, I knew it. Watch out, buddy. Oh, can't forget to lock up. So I finally got the bags open, guys, and look what we got here. Got the sweatsuit that I ordered, which also happens to be Champion. So shout out to Amazon Prime for having that hookup on that Champion. Um, and I got the two masks that I ordered, guys. Two masks I ordered. 
Got this clownish looking guy with his hat on his head. Got some bells in there. He looks really scary, guys. I'm really terrified of that one. And then we got my all-time favorite, Michael Myers. The guy that doesn't even talk, so I don't even know why I made my voice that deep. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be a kind of debate. Which one should I wear? What, what, what What's the scariest one, man? I mean, I'm hopping out of the refrigerator. You guys gotta help me. Is it scary to see a clown with a hat on hopping out the refrigerator with bells on and a black jumpsuit? Or is it scary to see Michael Myers? Because if I was Michael Myers, I would literally probably have to have a knife. I don't want to have to have a knife, so that probably crosses out Michael Myers. I kind of want to have the camera in my hand while being the Joker to kind of show their reaction, you know, because there won't be any other way to get their reaction unless I'm holding the camera. Um, now, obviously, I hope that they run away because of how scary it is. I hope no one's bold enough to sit there and say, wait a minute, why you got a camera? Because royalty's great at saying that stupid phrase. He always says, why are you recording? So hopefully royalty doesn't notice that I'm recording, guys. But anyway, I'm not talking your ear off. I'm finna get suited up because it's almost time for the kids to get out of school. Well, guys, I don't know. What do you think? Should I go with this or should I go with that? Can I go with this or can I go with that? No, I gotta get into character, guys. I gotta be more scary. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I don't know about this one, man. This one, this one might not be the one. But one, I can barely breathe. I can barely breathe in here, man. There's no opening at the mouth. It's only at the eyes. Can you even hear me? Uh, whoo. That was a lot harder than it looked, guys. Yeah, I think this is the one, guys. This is the one. I mean, just look at it, man. This is more scarier than a clown. I mean, because Michael Myers is a known serial killer, okay? Now, yes, people are scared of clowns, but this guy will actually kill your ass. So, guys, it looks like we will be going with Michael Myers. Hopefully, this is a successful prank. You see how much struggling I'm going through right now. And, oh yeah, I forgot. Refrigerator, man. Okay, guys, back and I'm fully committed to this. Royalty is gone. I don't got much time. I'm hiding everything in there, okay? I'm putting it in the boxes and hiding it in there. Might as well shut that off. I got a chance. drinks these. For a second, I thought I was gonna get stuck in there. Guys, it's gonna work out to perfection. I can feel it. As soon as I put that mask on, hop in there. As soon as they hop out, guys, this camera's gonna be over there. They won't see any of this, guys. It's gonna be a blast. Now, they will see these toys. Hopefully, they run straight over here. I don't know if I should wait for someone to open the refrigerator or if I should just pop out on them. I guess it's just depending on how cold it gets in there. Anyway, stay tuned for the most epic Halloween prank you ever seen. Ah, guys, help me out here, man. I'm a little gloss. I know that Michael Myers normally carries a knife like this, 
But this butcher knife is just so sexy. I don't know which one I want to hop out with. Now, I explained earlier that if I chose Michael Myers, ding, 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 that I would need a knife. So, we're here and I need a knife. Which one's more scarier? Hopping out the fridge with the butcher or just straight ready to shank some, you know what? That, that that feels a lot good. That motion, this this is too much. This is too much. So I, I'm gonna keep the knife. You know, I'm gonna keep it traditional, but hey, it was worth a try. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, but they almost home, so let's get ready. A few moments later. God, they are here. They are here. It's just a prank. Leave me alone. Daddy. Daddy. Nation. Nation, it's a prank, baby. It's a prank, Nation. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's a Halloween prank, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was a Halloween prank. Guys, it's just me, okay? I'm sorry, okay? Now, I took it too far, okay? Sorry. It's me. There's no monsters. Kaylion, Nation, Jalea. 
Talia? I'm sorry, guys. Rhino? I'm sorry, Rhino. Where you go, man? Hey, Rhino. It's me, Rhino. I'm sorry. I got the man. My, I got the monster, Rhino. Rhino, I got the monster. Rhino doesn't know who you are. sorry. Rhino, it's me. Rhino. It's me, man. You guys were scared. The refrigerator. <laughs> I came from the refrigerator. How did you fit in there? Oh, I took all this stuff out. What's wrong with you? I'm crazy because you guys made me this way. Remember with the pencil stuck in your high prank, Leon? Yeah. Yeah, Julie, you was in on that. Uh-huh. You guys were so scared. Leah. You guys were so scared. <laughs> in there? <laughs> That's crazy. Everything's in here. So this is what you do while I'm gone? <laughs> what, what little time you give me. Oh, but did you guys notice the toys that I used as a distraction? Oh, yeah, Are those cool for yeah. makeup? Well, All right. I steal your money. What? <laughs> Why do you steal my you money? Need to turn this thing off. You need to turn it back on. Hey, don't worry about me. I got it, man. You need to be more concerned about how long I was in there and how hot I was about to die, sweating to death. What took you so long to come home? Yeah, what was you doing? I was getting the yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. They had a big Halloween party. Have you ever there. have you ever been more scared? Mom, was that the scariest prank mom, ever? Mommy, mommy never come back. Oh, you oh, you got me right in my stomach. Ow. Oh, oh. Where's the water? I'm sorry, it's That's all in there. Everything's water. in there. Guys, big W's in the comment section right now. You already know. You've probably never seen anything more successful than that on my channel. And I'm glad to announce that I wasn't the one getting pranked this time. I was the one pulling the strings. And guys, they look pretty scared to me. I'm talking tears, screaming, running. That was not fake. That was all legitness, man. It was so fun being behind that mask. It was hot. I ain't gonna lie. It was definitely hot, but it was fun. Who's gonna put this stuff back? How about that? Yeah, I was, I was gonna do that. You ain't gotta worry about that. I was gonna do that. But this is our time right now. I took the W. You see how Royal you try to play me to the left oh, and try to slide that. somebody else in on my stuff? No, man. This is my time for me to shine, man. Congrats to me for pulling off one of the most successful Halloween pranks ever. Dab, and I'm out. Peace. Last night took a L, but tonight I bounce back. Wake up every morning, by the night I count stacks. That was real when I hit it, bounce back. You ain't getting checks. Last night took an L, but tonight I bounce back. Boy, I've been broke as hell. Catch the check and bounce back. D-Town LAX, every week I bounce back.